Jamie ought to, it felt a bit flat today. I can't put any words. That performance, uh, it's, it's baffling. Absolutely baffling. Uh, something's got to change. Something's got to change. I don't know whether, is it personnel or, or team shape or... I don't know, but same again, I'm in here. I don't feel Edinburgh City's caused us any sort of problem whatsoever and going beat 2-0. I'm honestly, I'm same again, I'm absolutely raging. I, you can probably see it and sense it. It's, I, it's, it's so difficult to put into words, see this. It's, it's one of the ones like, I can't believe we're 2-0 down, but in what I said to Duff, Rob Otomo in there, it's the same thing we're seeing every week. It's just, honestly, it's the same thing every week. I'm saying to the boys and we do so well in the game. I like, you, you look at the stats today, I reckon we're 70% possession. Yeah. And, all right, football's about scoring goals. We've created five or six good, glaring chances. So, the boys have got to take them. Mm -hmm. And I can, I can, take full responsibility for it, and I wish I will, uh, but I'm looking for them to do a wee bit better in front of goal. That's, that's the be all end all. I can't have them coming in and every other week and saying, oh, we're unlucky today and unlucky. And no, it's not unlucky. You, you get what you deserve at a football match, and today we probably deserve to be beat 2-0 because I'm not taking away from Edinburgh City. They were clinical in front of goal. They had two shots and goals scored two, two or so. Aye, it's... It's no, it's no good. No good. And again, it felt like they are two shots. Sorry, they are two goals. They're awfully cheap. <laughs> I, 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 I'm scratching my head and I'm thinking the first one after 45 seconds. It's everything's up on the ta everything's up on the board uh, to see where you are and who you're picking up and people try to do other people's job. Don't do it, just do what you've been told to do. And that's what happens, that was a downfall. There was a mistake after a mistake, two mistakes leads to the goal. Yeah. I think the ball just gets swung in, we should have somebody in the front area, he tries to go and affect the game there. Somebody moves off the back post and at the front area, nowhere near good enough. At this level, and it proven to the Edinburgh City, put a good ball in the box and nine times out of ten we should deal with it. And today we don't because we take it into our own hands and thinking, I'll do somebody else's job before doing your own job. And it made it look like a really weird game, so watching the first half, we went that golden in the first minute. Apart from that, nothing for Edinburgh City. We created great chances, but, but the other end we can't score, as you said. That's football, isn't it? You've got to take your chances. <laughs> Gary Naismith, yet again, says to me, after eight, nine minutes, you get him two or three knocks, three one up. Uh, it was, and like I said that to you last week, another manager says that to me, I, I don't want to hear it, it's easy enough when you've come away from here with uh, three points and you can say that to another manager. Uh, but listen, I'm not I'm no saying anything about Gary Naismith here or whatever, but listen, I know Gary well, lovely man, uh, but it's, it's unfortunately we're coming away with three points and that's, that's it. Any issues with Tommy's red card? We'll keep that in the house to be honest with you. Uh, it's, you know, Tommy's a... I'm not saying he's a up, up top end of the pitch. You see him making naked attackers all the time, and for their bench as well, said never a red card straight away. Uh, but listen, the referee's made a decision, uh, and you've got to stick with the decision. In my view, was it a red card? Possibly a wee bit soft, but as I say, it's 48 minutes and it takes the stuff in it. You but same again, the boys didn't. The, the boys didn't stop in the second half. Uh, they kept going, and as you say, another sloppy goal. Uh, a ball into the box, we don't defend it. I know we're trying to kind of go to the other end and get a goal, but you've, you've still got to just defend a cross ball uh, and an easy header at the back stick. And 2 0 down, you still try and chase the game, and it just petered out. It was, uh, as I say, I'm devastated uh, that we've actually came away with, with nothing today. Is this the angriest you've been at full time, do you reckon? Yeah, 100%. Yeah, 100%. And the manner that we've lost that game today, yes. Uh, and at half time, I had a wee pop at the boys, but no to say, like, these have been terrible or whatever. 
I just said, look, we just need to keep chipping away, keep keep doing the right things. And obviously Tommy goes out after 40 minutes, I think, straight red card and you're backs against the wall. But no backs against the wall, whereas you're defending your own box because both halves that were played inside Edinburgh six half. Uh, I don't really think they get out much and the two times they get out they end up scoring goals so full credit to them, they were clinical in front of goal today and we were a million miles away from it in front of and goal. I've said before about that there's still games to play to, to mount a playoff challenge etc but obviously time, time's running out so I need to put a run together if they want to finish in the top four. Listen, uh, I looked at these games obviously Elgin, uh, Steny uh, and Albion Rovers in today's game as well. But let's not be careful. I was looking to take twelve points for the next four, uh, and that's what I said to the boys in there as well. I said I'm, I'm looking to take twelve points for these next four games. And why, why can we not? Because we've got a team there. We, we create chances every week. You watch it, but at the end of the day, something, something's got to give. Uh, and we've got a, as a background staff, uh, we've got to kind of try and put a finger on it and make sure. We keep creating chances, and we've got to take chances. And if you watch, you probably watch match of the day night, the FA Cup, and you see teams maybe at kind of low level, uh, and they'll get one chance and they'll take it. Today we've had four or five, and we've not took one in. They've took two chances, two shots and goal, and took them. So we need to be clinical in opposition box and clinical defending in our own box, and we've done neither today.